Yeah. If they, people can see us back home, how we walking around, no mask, let's see what in the world. Yeah, that's why I'm, that's, I was yeah, you're just saying that. Ain't yeah. no mask I bet they cursing me right now. Talking about Tan, Tanza, what? Where you at? <laughs> Have you posted a business on Facebook? Yeah, I put I, what, on the first day we got back. Any likes from anybody? People that I normally would get them from. Okay. Africans that I'm cool with in, in Ghana, of course, you know, they're going to like it. Especially when I took the picture with uh, Mama Imus. They're going to see him. Once people see him back home, it's going to spread. Right now, they're just absorbing. Like, how you get Hold on, hold on. He work? <laughs> they got to clear it up first. They got to make sure. <laughs> then they got to look on Google and find a tens of words at it. Exactly. And then they gonna, that's when it's going to spread. Oh, and Lord, the host, you post the pictures out of Safari. You know what I mean? All right, exactly. I ain't post them yet. Yeah. I think I'll post when I get back. <laughs> See, I don't want to. I don't want to uh, shock this system too much. <laughs> I, 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 I'm gonna I'm I'm get the information out, kind of like a, 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 a IV. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so you smell it? Yeah. Well, they probably not used to you know smelling it like walking. You know. He sure smell it. But he pointed to his nose. Watch your step, watch your step. That's why I brought mine. Oh, where is that going? She back there. Oh, there you go. Step back. My lady over there cooking. Watch it, watch it, watch it. Bus stop, bus stop. Get it, get it. <laughs> come on, come on. Show, show.
why are you on the sidewalk? I should, hey, I should have put my arm out of clothes lying his ass. Shit. Yeah. You know you don't put me on the side. Remember I told you they don't have no license? Yeah. yeah. Remember I said, they show, that show, that, see what I mean? What's that, plantain? What's that, plantain? Is it? No. It's kind of, it's kind of big to be plantain. Made here, the I mean, in the, in the, in the country. You said another one? There could be another export made here if they made here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Another one. We're going to be having to do the same thing. I know, I know. We can't be an American unless we hustle.
Okay. Oh, no. Come on. I don't need anything. I'm just walking. Stretching my legs, man. Post office. Over there. To your right. Oh, they got, look, they got this. Huh. <laughs> right. Look, it just saw me out of the church over there. Well, watch it, watch it. Yeah, because you know, they're at home, they might, they might stop. Yeah. Here they might not. Yeah. <laughs> Roundabout. Four C's, they got the four season right there on that corner. Oh, you want to get to America? No, no, no. Okay, let's cross you later. Let's cross you. Medical. Yeah, we've all got medical. Yeah, okay, you got to <laughs> so you got a coach, you good, huh? Good. It's probably close, huh? It's kind of early. It's kind of open. Don't stop it, that's it. Post office. See, 8 o'clock. Are they open? Um, Maybe not. I think Kobe got him. Morning, morning, morning. You speak English? Yes. You do? Yes, I do. No, you don't. I do. Say something in English. Like what? <laughs> you say something. Um, you got it? Can you open this? Oh, we don't open. It ain't open then. You got to open it. Somebody just open. Yes, no problem. In Florida? Nah, no. I'm from Chicago. Chicago Bulls. 
That's right. How much is that? Yes. Yeah, I got sold for eight. We use this in the States. You got any Benadryl? What? Benadryl. Benadryl? Yeah. What's that for? It's like for uh, if you have an uh, allergic reaction for bug bites or bee stings. So applying or medicine to take? It's usually to, you ingest it. The ones that we have, it's clarity. Yeah, but that's for more allergy. I'm saying for like bug bites. The bug bites that we have, it's so it apply instantly and it stop the bite? The, yeah. the bite, I mean the uh, the itching and all that? Okay, give me that time. I think that's all I need. What is that, uh, what's that milky? The, the one right there. No, the other, the other one, yeah. What is that? For who? COVID. For COVID? Yeah. Get out of here. <laughs> really? Let me see. It's for COVID? Yeah, it is. Really? What is it made? It's, cool. yeah, it's for COVID. <laughs> I know, right? He said, anyway. I'm going to tell something. <laughs> no problem, no problem, no problem. <laughs> Akuma, Akuma Matata, I think it's called. Well, we got him already. Nah, she rich. 
Cybernet. Akuma Matata. Akuma Matata. Akuma. Hakuna. Hakuma. Hakuma. You got to say it slow, man. Hakuma Matata. No problem. I know what I mean. No problem. The rich lady. Welcome Arusha. Welcome Tanzania. Welcome Tanzania. Yeah. Arusha. Eh, Karibu Arusha. Arusha. Karibu. Yes. I have plenty of necklaces. You have this? Yes, I have plenty. I come to Africa all the time, man. Different countries, so. This is where we go? Oh, I thought he was pointing over there. Like, where? Oh. We can film, can we? Go. Can we film? Huh? Yes, sir. Okay. What is it? Blowout sale? Oh, no. Huh? Clearance? This clearance? Everything must go. Is it clearance out? It's really. Which one you have at first I was thinking this one. And I'm like, this is so cool. And like, supreme oil over here, you want to see animals. So I'm going back to this one. Because this one gives you animals, culture, animals. I don't wear bracelets. All I wear is watch. That's it. No necklace, no bracelets, nothing. So big it. This is a type of uh, Tansonite place. It's between these two. Or actually this one, but if you don't want to do black and white. Yeah, I mean, is it for a lady? Okay, you can come in. Malcolm. <laughs> Oh, he got it. I'm getting unemployment right so, now. Sorry. So, you rich. That's what it's about. Do not feel bad to tell those boys. Check the and also Let's show you kind of how the mining is looks like inside. And then there's another room there where you can watch how they do it. Lastly, is those antique made draw wardrobes where you can uh, see the fully punched or loose uh, pieces of tanzanite. And if you can, if you really want to buy it, you can get it from there. If you want to take tanzanite, mm -hmm. after there we we'll, we'll do the whole set up. There we're done. While you're doing this, I'll go out again and look up for this um, magnet because I tried to ask even those ask even those boys, nobody is really aware. Of it. So we may spend here like half an hour, is okay? Okay. Okay. You say that touch. Okay. We we'll spend like half an hour. But I will be back soon. Once we're done here, we walk down to our place. Okay. That's fine. Or oh, 20 minutes, 20 minutes here, then we'll walk out. <laughs>
I'm just joking. I'm just joking, 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 joking. Okay, please. She will get in control and she will explain you what's done the line, how we do. We came up here because this is something we own. Oh, okay, great. As the Tanzanians. As Tanzanians own this? Okay. We own Very good. That's why we call it Tanzanite One. So I was wondering what it's called. Okay. I'll, I'll bring it to you. Hello. Hello. How are you? How are you? Fine. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. Okay. My name is Tabitha, and I'll be your guide for your talk today. Our talk consists of two sections. One is ten minute documentary video show. Second, we get to see how Tanzanite is mined into an African Tanzanite mine shaft, and third, we get a chance to see our fine collection in the show. Do you have time for that? Yes. yes. Okay, before we start, may I have you some refreshments? It's our treat. We have some coffee, tea, water. Coffee. Please, coffee. Welcome. Coffee. Coffee. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, ready? Okay. We'll do, we'll take the coffee after a okay. tour. Okay. Because it's not ready, I can speak. Okay. You may proceed to the she document. She will wait for her to come back or she'll come. Okay. Now it's just direct. Uh, yes, I'm going to show she went to the washroom and wait for her here. Hello. Hey, how you doing? Fine, fine. Yes. <laughs> it's familiar. Tanzanite is a synonymous source, which will only last for one generation. 
making it a thousand times rarer than diamond. This means the coming generation will have to either buy the stone as a second or third hand or inherit the stone in the family as an heir. Apart from Tanzanite being a single source in the world, it has a unique character of being tricolor, which means in a single piece, when it's in a rough form, it ripens in three exquisite colors. Those colors are blue, violet, and burgundy. And each of those colors has a different color giving element. Nobody had ever seen anything like art before. So art treasure, by magic, the symbol of a family's heritage. A treasure was kept a secret until 1966, when a local man called Juman Nevoa took an initiative and take the stone to the National Geologic Laboratory in the Noma. After carefully examining the stone, the geologist communicated back to Juman Nevoa, stating that the stone that he brought belonged to the Blue Zoicide family, a volcanic crystal. But before they knew it, somebody gave a hint to Tiffany. He knew not that a brand new chunk stone just has been discovered in East Africa. That stone that was once used to play manga was cut for the first time by Tiffany. A year later, Tiffany gave the blue shimmering stone a name, Tanzanite. They did so by combining the country where the crystal originated, Tanzania, and the family of the stone that it belonged to. So, Tanzanite means Tanzania suicide. We are now going underground. We will use a scale to get there. The distance from the surface to the bottom is all about a thousand meters here, and it takes about 15 minutes to get there. Once we are there, the geologists will begin to locate the vein and find the faults. Where we are right now is down to the shaft. Uh, we are checking the passage of the material. Then we will drill the air by using a drill. Then we will drill it. We will insert dynamite and explode the air. Within the bed, we have a probability of finding tanzanite alongside other minerals. They all will be collected, food on a whole bags, tied up with the monoliths. They will be transferred to the surface for processing. Once the stone has been gone through the processing section, they are taken in to the sort house. Here, the stone will go through the sorting and cooling, after which they will be ready for cut and polish. This stage will be handled by highly skilled and experienced gemstone cutters. This is the phone that I'm going to make up a phone. Kwanza tunapima size, kuna mungu blangati, tusha maliza, tunakwenda kumpishia kini mashini. Tunapishia kuhu ya mungu, kuhu ya kuhu ya kuhu. Fani shepo, mashini ya sawa, tusha maliza, kuhu ya pili, unakwenda umachoma mungu. Na ingiza kwa ikawo pena, unachoma masama hini, kwa hivi ya miyatano. Mbada ya hako, unatua kwenye hipo, tunayenda kwenye mwishu, unakutana. After the stone goes through the cutting and polishing process, they'll be taken to the laboratory for grading and certification. All of our stone, after cutting and polishing, we take them to the Tanzanite laboratory for the grading, and we grade according to the Tanzanite quality scale, which is internationally recognized system for the grading of the Tanzanite, and it grades the stone according to the four C's: color, clarity, cut, and cartridge. What was there a rock before? Now. And when transformed into gemstone, it can then be set in any jewelry of different styles as per client's preferences. On the notion of basic principle practice, the Tanzanite experience conducts its operations based on the value and virtues of ethical mining. We're empowering most ladies economically by giving them skills on how to make jewelries. We supply them with unpolished stones and wires to make the jewelries. And then after, we help them sell. The revenue that comes from the sales goes back to them and benefit the entire family. 
This man was a stone collector at the foothills of Mount Kilimanjaro, whereby he came across a translucent crystal. But nobody could hardly tell what was a crystal till 1967, when it was taken to Tanzania National Geological Laboratory. So a few men were excited, and this man were. These are the men, eh? Right, right. This men were Shinja Mayaya, Ali Juawatu, and Emmanuel de Souza. Emmanuel de Souza was a Portuguese, and he's the one who took extra measure by sending the crystal to Tiffany in Cohen, New York. Mm. So mm. after mm. Tiffany mm. testing the crystal, it was confirmed to belong to the Blue Zoicide family. Zoicide is a mineral group. So what Tiffany did, she just took the two letter T, E, and named the crystal Tanzanite, 
after the origin came to Tanzania and to grow the tree of the country. All right. The Portuguese. So they took, they, did they take control of it? No, the Tanzanian, the Tanzanian guys. Okay. Okay, so it's always there. He just took it to yeah, Tiffany, he said. Okay. He took it to Tiffany. Okay. Yeah. So we are about to go to the replica. Currently, Marina, 1,000 meters. Please, you're welcome. So these are the main gears. The main gears is there. So what you see inside this replica, it's a really my shaft from mm. Mary Lani. Mm. So Tanzanite, it's based on exploring and locating veins. So these mm. are the budding veins. Okay. In which Tanzanite forms alongside a lot of other minerals. It appears as an L shape or a Z shape, which is named after the French name Buddha, meaning sausage. Just as sausage has got many ingredients, likewise to Tanzanite has got many other minerals that accompanies it at the pudding because it doesn't come alone. Mm. So therefore, the gemologists will mark that we insert the dynamite not too far and not too close, so that they may not damage the mm. minerals. Mm. They also mine fancy Tanzanite. These fancy Tanzanite are not heated, they're natural from the pudding. Mm. So they come in different colors, they come in green, they come in pink, they come in champagne, and they're not little, just like down. Yeah. Was it rel relatively safe in the mines? Did they have any problems with mines caving in or anything? Yeah, a long time ago they have that problem. Mm -hmm. yeah. But now Much they're safe. professional and they're working well there because the government has taken it over there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Tanzanian government. Mm. So over here, we may come just close and see the mineral. But a company stands right at the beginning. You see all these minerals. Mm -hmm. A company stands right where it is mining. So we have the quartz. This is gypsum, graphite. Right. And this is pirate. No pirate, full skull. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And this is a raw tanzanite. Mm -hmm. You can touch it and feel it. That is mm -hmm. how it comes from the ground. Mm -hmm. So it's a raw tanzanite. Yeah. Yeah. So this is this is pretty much how it was when they were just using it to play games with. Right. Exactly. Okay. Yes. Bow. Yeah. Bow. 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 Who's who said? Quartz. 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 Yes. Quartz. So that's a raw tanzanite, and you can see it is attached to green granite. Green granite is mined in Kenya, Madagascar, mm -hmm. and in Tanzania, and it is also a precious stone. Mm -hmm. This is like a protection, right? Yeah, this is a pirate. Mm -hmm. Good, good. Mm -hmm. Which one? Let me see which one's going on. Oh, yeah, I got, I got it. Somebody gave me a necklace. It's okay. Okay, now after the blast of these minerals, it often turns into shimmering wall, and this wall is known as sugar wall. Mm -hmm. Sugar wall. Okay. Sugar you wall. see the shimmering, eh? I, yeah, like, I, like, I like sugar walls. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So it turns into shimmering wall, and this wall is That's known shimmering. as sugar wall. Or in Swahili, we call it Ukutawa sky. Okay. So we therefore find tanzanite well embedded on the rocks to be carefully extracted with a technique called face picking. They selected a few miners to carry out the task, depending mm. on the quality. Mm. So after extracting now tanzanite from the mine face, it's carefully locked up in these steel boxes you see here. So it's recorded, locked up here, taken to the surface to the sort house under very tight security. Mm. Again, inside this obac, you see here, so these are the mineral produced from the explosive which is attached to this monorock. This is a heavy duty rock, which runs the length of the mine shaft. Again, taken to the surface to the processing plant, whereby now the material will be cleaned, crushed, and mm. tanzanite is separated from the ore. Okay. Mm. Then it is categorized into gem quality and opaque quality. We also have a ventilation tube. For the fresh air. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this is this is all the 
in recent times yes. to help the men out. Sure. There's no ladies down there doing work? Most no. of them are men. Most of them are men. No ladies, in other words. Okay. <laughs> so you're welcome to the other side. The other side? Okay. Oh. I guess you'd be disappointed to find out that I work for the Long Island Railroad right now. No, I wouldn't let disappoint me. I was asking the question. <laughs> so all these are companies thousand I twenty to mine at the Budin. Mm. Yeah. So you can see the food's gone. Everybody want a piece. Yes, yes, yes. You see the green garnet on that side, the corner? Yes, right here. No, you see this crystal here? This, mm -hmm. this yeah. one was burned because the dynamite were too close. Whoa. The tarzanite crystal. Though out of this, we can make tarzanite carbon. Mm. You said it was banned? Mm -hmm. Why again? Because the dynamite were very close. Oh, the dynamite? Because when they were inciting those dynamite. They were very close, okay. so they got damaged, they got burned. Oh, okay. So also of this, you can make okay. tarzanite okay. carbon. Okay. Yeah. The tarzanite carbon, they are the carbon that you can't cut, just fold it. Because if you cut, they break due to the inclusion. Okay. Yeah. You can hmm. make rings and fingers. And fool's go, huh? Mm -hmm. This is fool's go, yeah. <laughs> So most of this gemstone are for construction. Mm. Oh. Yeah, for the gypsum. You have graphite for pencil. Mother rock. Oh, for pencils. Yeah, it's a yeah. mother rock. <laughs> the lead. Yeah, graphite, eh? Oh, yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, it's for oh, pencil. Okay. Yeah. 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 So this is going to be your first one to get a little uh, gemstone on the hand that somebody's going to get one. I'm about to get all of them. You can be a volunteer. A volunteer. Uh -huh. Okay, we have this part here, cutting and polishing process. It's a very important part. Yes, it is. It requires the skills of a highly trained gem cutter. And again, it takes many years for one to learn to become a gem cutter. For instance, here in Tanzania, experience, you only have two gem cutters. The importance of cutting is due to the fact that it brings out the beauty in mm -hmm. the brilliance of the stone. So the better the cut, the more brilliant the stone has. Mm. Over here, we also have a cutting table. You may proceed. Oh, I had a question. Yeah. So what, are, what is the process of becoming a gem cutter? Is there a a degree you get, a training, or how do you of course. qualify? Yeah, it's a I mean, training, yeah, I know. It's a dynamic exercise. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It takes like 10 years. Oh, 10 years? Yeah. Okay. okay. So over here we have a cutting table. This is called dog stick. And this is wax. Yeah. It's get heated fast. Then the stone is mounted on top, I'll show you here. And then you use this blend, which contains diamond. Diamond is the hardest. It is 10 on the most scale, the alternate is 6.5 to 7. Mm. And this trap you see here, it runs water to cool down when the heat is very high, not to break the stone. So these are the degrees. And then when you go down very fast, yeah. you make this cut. You determine maybe a cushion cut or a square cut. So after cutting, you use this wheel to polish. The rubberized wheel, and the wheel also will be going round. So we will polish the stone, then we will melt this wax mm -hmm. and turn it over, and then polish the pavilion part. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And these are the index. Are those certain methods that they um, able to um, use it? Each one is a different level of how you of, 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 of solving it. Exactly. Yes. You see all of them. The dupes. There's different shapes on the end, look by that. Depending on the size of the stone, how small it is. We also have a big crystal here, which was mm -hmm. damaged during the mining process. It's 4.5 kg. Mm -hmm. It's a mother rock. 
the mother oh, of it's not no. the quality, yeah, it's the mother. You can see all the combination of the minerals. Mm -hmm. You can see graphite, mm -hmm. and see gypsum, mm -hmm. down the light here, it's a mother. So mm -hmm. it's not a gene quality. Again, tanzanite is graded similar to diamond. According to the forces criteria, we have the color, current, current, and current range. We will proceed to show the grading. of the stone. The cut should not be too deep nor too shallow. It should be a well cut so that it can reflect light to create a maximum brilliance of the stone. And these are the different cuts that we have in our shop. Then we have the fourth C, carriage weight, is the term used to measure tanzanite, which weighs one over fifth of a gram. So in purchasing tanzanite, you consider the four C, the color, clarity, cut, and carriage weight. The more included, just like diamonds, the more included, exactly, just the least expensive it is. Yeah. Okay. So over here, you can come close and see the process that tanzanite goes through from rough, curving, tree shape, heating, and cutting. And tanzanite is heated to enhance the color. Mm. Nice. And down the line, mm -hmm. this is the. satisfied here and each piece is accompanied by certificate of authenticity. So before we feel free to look at our final collection, our coffee is ready. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for supporting the Go ahead. Okay, so this side you see the blue color. Yeah. Um can you see violet on that angle? Yeah. Yeah. And then on the long axis, you get to see burgundy. Oh, wow. Yeah. What the hell? So that's the only stone which does that with the light. Three see? different colors. Three different colors. That's the mystery. You hear that, Mama? Give me the one with the three different colors. <laughs> <laughs> she focused on that money over there. Uh -huh. That is amazing. It is. It is. You see how I turned it to uh, see burgundy this, or whatever? Uh, the blue, yeah. Show them the burgundy part. See that? 
Wow. Okay, so this angle, the blue. Okay. Then can you see purple from that? Purple? Uh huh. Purple. And then back in. The you see that? <laughs> <laughs> Only That's in Tanzania, right? Only Tanzania. Tanzania. Yes. That's awesome. Yes. Let's go in and mine again. <laughs> yeah, let me buy mine.